اليوم بعنوان salivary gland we have a three salivary gland uh, parotid gland submandibular and sublingual parotid gland it is the biggest one which is lies below the ear between the angle of the ramus of the mandible and sternomastoid muscle it is the biggest one and it is it is lies outside the mouth cavity and drain its secretions within the mouth cavity it is inverted pyramid in shape uh, it has an a base above, apex below, superior border, anterior border, posterior border. It has three surfaces, superficial surface, and two surfaces which is inside, which is called anterior medial surface and posterior medial surface. There is a duct which is emerges from the anterior border of the gland, uh, pass it over and runs over the masseter's muscles, then it pierces the buccal pad of fat, buccal buccopharyngeal fascia, buccinator muscles, and buccal mucous membrane to reach the mouth cavity to open in the vestibule of the mouth opposite to the upper second molar tooth in both sides right and left side uh, its length about five centimeter and uh, centimeter uh, uh, centimeter and it is lies superficial in the face it is very important to know the relations of the parotid gland second gland which is the, the submandibular gland Second one, which is submandibular gland, which is lying in the submandibular fossa and in the inner surface of the ramus of the mandible. Submandibular gland the, it has two parts, superficial part and deep part, which is divided by the mylohyoid muscle. The deep part, which is lies deep to the anterior, uh, above the mylohyoid muscle, uh, mylohyoid muscle has its duct on the, uh, emerges from its anterior, uh, anterior border. Also, there is very important relations about the superficial part. It has the three surfaces, uh, superficial surface, medial surface, and lateral surface. The deep part lies deep or in, in, uh, above the mylohyoid muscle, has the duct which is passing anteriorly till the till reach the level of the le, le, le floor of mouth beside the frenulum beside the frenulum where is two small babili where is its opening its length about five centimeters and has a triple relations with the lingual nerve another gland which is called the smallest one which is called sublingual gland her name the يوضح لك المكان بتاع their site it is lies below the tongue here, here in this area, and it is very small glands, and, and it has many ducts, which is opening directly into the floor of mouth.